So my name is Luis Leva. I'm an assistant professor of mathematics education in the Department of Teaching and Learning here at Peabody College of Education and Human Development. Uh, so I completed my undergraduate degree in mathematics at Rutgers University and then I went on to pursue a Master's of Education in Math Education at Rutgers University as well. I have a professional experience in working with summer bridge programs and uh, living learning communities for a number of years. And in, during that time as a math teacher and as a coordinator and mentor through these programs, um, I was beginning to see that acad well, academic is, achievement is very important for students. There's also an equally important responsibility amongst institutions of higher education to be able to support students with navigating STEM and math classroom spaces from a social standpoint. Before I became a mathematics major in my undergraduate years, I wanted to pursue a chemistry major. Something that comes with that curriculum is organic chemistry, where I was helping fellow students in my organic chemistry class and thinking about heats of combustion. In that moment, I had a very kind of meta uh, line of thinking where I was seeing myself engage in practices that math educators engage with. So helping other students, my peers, think critically about what's going on here in the chemistry, but what's going on mathematically that makes meaning of the chemistry that's happening with heats of combustion. So it was in those moments where I realized that I really wanted to make a difference as a math educator, so I ended up switching my major uh, to mathematics, after that pursuing a doctoral degree in math education. If you're hearing from someone that they got a great grade on, on a mathematics test of some sort, the perceptions of you communicating to that to other individuals, that could be you know, judged racially, it could be judged gendered in gendered ways. So you know, in addition to kind of this piece about feeling like the quote unquote only one, or feeling as though your, your, your underrepresentation is pretty salient in that context, I think it's also important to think about um, interpersonal dynamics, right? So the ways in which some of your actions, your behaviors, your dialogue is being perceived by others as well, and how individuals may manage and engage in certain strategies to shape their identities. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, but it's more than that. You know, there's a big push to be able to increase retention across the STEM pipeline in math and science and other STEM fields, but there's also an equally important impetus to be able to increase retention and sustain uh, positive experiences for STEM teachers, right? So oftentimes we're inspired to pursue STEM because we had teachers in our classrooms who allowed us to embrace some of that. In thinking about those terms, there's almost this notion of kind of paying it forward paying it forward through your work as an educator in maybe the same ways that a past educator has done that for you.